Hey, Blake here, the drink chef and your personal bartender. And today, I'd like to show you how to make an old fashioned. And there's a couple of different ways to make an old fashioned. And the new style way of making one uses a cherry, a wedge of orange, and muddles that at the bottom of a bucket glass with bitters, sugar, water, and whiskey. But we're not going to make it just that way. So I'm going to get rid of the cherry and the old school, traditional way of making an old fashioned uses the peels of citrus. So I've got a nice potato peeler and I'm gonna get a really big, long, diagonal cut peel off of this orange. That one's good enough for the garnish, so I'm gonna save that for later. And I'm gonna do another nice long peel off of the orange and use this one in the drink. I'm gonna give it just a little bit of a fold and drop that in there. Okay, now I'll do the same thing with the lemon, but I'm only gonna take one peel of the lemon Nice big long peel, give that a fold, drop that into the drink. Okay, now I'm gonna take some sugar, I like sugar in the raw, and pour that down into the drink too. Okay, I'm gonna take three shakes of Angostura bitters. There's a lot of different brands and a lot of different flavors. I like Angostura in this drink. One, two, three. Okay, now, I'm gonna take just a little bit of water, two spoons of water, and pour that in there. That'll help dilute the drink just a little bit, but it'll also help the sugar dissolve in the drink. Now I'll take my muddler, and I'll macerate this fruit at the bottom of the glass. Try and get all the oils mixed in with the bitters and the sugar. Okay, that's good enough. All right, now I'm going to fill this with ice and I'm going to pour two ounces of bourbon whiskey. You can use Canadian whiskey, Tennessee whiskey. I'm just going to use some bourbon whiskey in here. I'm going to use two ounces of that. Beautiful. I'm going to give it a little stir. Whoops. Okay. I'm going to take that twist that I saved, that peel, and twist it. Make a nice little barrel twist, give it a little tug, and you can see the oils coming off of that, and I can smell them. I'm going to rim the glass a little bit, leave that on top, and we're ready to serve. That is a classic, old school, old fashioned. Cheers.